How would you like it if you never have to write a blog post again, that you have a software that will write these articles for you, where you have the latest news on your website, all on autopilot? Well, today I'll be reviewing Blogi, which is a brand new software that allows you to create these posts for you. Now, before I dive into this review, in case you're interested, make sure to check out the link in the description where you can get access. Uh, you can get my coupon for a discount as well if you get the bundle deal uh, and also some extras if you pick this up through my link. For now, let's dive into this and let me show you how you can create blog posts like this. So this is my WordPress website and I have not written these articles. Blogi did this, did this for me. It works really simple. So on the left side here, when you click on campaigns, you can create new campaigns. Now, this is a ready campaign that has written all the articles for me. So basically in a single campaign, you can say post new post every single day. If I like to create an extra campaign, I click on add campaign and I can say here, for example, digital marketing. My topic is also digital marketing. And then in this section, I can give my login details, special login details to my blog. So this works really simple when you go to your WordPress website here. You can go to your users. And when I go to my username, I can say my username here is Tim. And then I can create a new application password here that I can fill out. So let's let's do this actually. So let's say this is blogy2. I say new application. So this is my application password here. And now I can put that here as my password. My login is Tim. And I also need to fill out my blog. So this is my website. This is my demo site. I'm going to fill that out in here. Now, then I can say I want to publish automatically or in draft. And I can set the keywords. So I can say digital marketing again here. Because I want to target these keywords. So I can click on the plus here. Now I have digital marketing. Now, on the next page here, this is one of the coolest features, in my opinion, of Blogi, is I can add source websites. Now, for example, I have here social media today. I can copy this website. I can go to Blogi here. I can paste that in here. And then the only thing that I need to have is a selector from a website. And they explain how this works. But basically, you open an article in here and then you right click you inspect this, and the only thing that you have to do is you need to select the article here. So this is, for example, here, article large. I think this is it. Here, so we right click here, we copy the selector here. We go back to Blogi, we put that in here, and we click on plus, and now you can see it automatically uh, gets the articles from the website. So you can already select which uh, post you would like to copy. So you can say, I want to have, uh, let's say, Meta Expands, Snapchat announces, let's say, Instagram launches. Uh, yep, let's say those three here, and I'm going to click Add. And now these have been added already to this specific campaign. So now I can click Next, and I can add multiple websites here. So it's pretty cool. From here, I can post every single day here. I can say I want to post every minute or maybe every hour or every day or every single month here. Uh, but let's say we want to post every here. You can say every two days starting on Sunday or on Monday, whatever day you prefer. Or you can say I want to have specific days of the week. I want to post on Sundays, on Tuesdays and on Thursdays and on on Saturdays, for example, or maybe you want to do a specific day of the month here that you say the first and the fifth, you can all schedule that. Let's set this to every two day here. Now let's unselect this one. Uh, I think I can do it like this here. And then I'm going to click next here. Now from here, you have the option to choose your model here. Now a lot of of models are available. So not only you have access to ChatGPT, you also have access to Cloud here, to Mosaic, uh, to Palm, to Cloud, to, to Gemini, to Mistral. All these writers are uh, available to you, which means that you can have different varieties of writing on your website, which is really good for SEO purposes. And by the way, I haven't told you that yet, but Blogi optimizes all your articles uh, with SEO, uh, all Google-friendly content. So 
let's say we want to use, let's say Gemini One Pro here. And then you can select the language. So all the languages that are supported by this specific uh, writing engine are in here. So let's say we want to do English. And here you can type the style. So we're going to do professional here. So it writes professional blog posts for us. And you can also do a style sample. You can write a style sample, a personality. If you like to fill that out, that's also possible. In this case, I just like to leave it blank. If you like to create images, so if you do images, it will generate images with AI for your blog posts as well. And then rewrite paragraph by paragraph. And this consumes more credits. I'll talk about the credits a little later. Uh, but writes even better content. So you can say yes or no, whatever you prefer. And then you can set the word count in here. So you can go up to 2,500 words per post, which is a lot. Uh, but you can also say, hey, I want to have a thousand words per post on general. And you have also a smart mode here, uh, a multipass AI algorithm that ensures the word length is closer to the required. And this uses more credits. So we're not going to select this one. Simply going to hit next here. Now you can also uh, do something in the footer. Uh, you could do something like subscribe here. Something like this, subscribe to my newsletter and then your website URL. Uh, you can rewrite this part of the footer every single time if you like to. Now you can also links to promote in articles. So if you have a link text, you can say, for example, here, um, free uh, PDF, and then you can link to your link here. So HTTPS, and then one to tree.com, and then your PDF, and then you can say plus here, and then it will link to those PDFs if you like to. Uh, you can also keep the original links from the article, yes or no, and then the queue size, which means that it sets articles, uh, it writes the articles up front for you. So you can say, hey, do two up front, and then when you click finish here it will be posted. Now, I already created this campaign with this specific website here. So I'm going to show you it in here. You can see this in here. So when we go to the articles, you can see that these articles have been written for me. And as you can see here, one is in draft as well. So this is an article that has been written for me. As you can see here, you can see the whole post in here. And then it has a meta description here. This is all SEO optimized with a meta description. It has meta keywords. It has tags. It automatically creates categories to your blog. It automatically creates a SEO optimized slug here. Uh, excerpt here as well. So it creates all of that for you. So what we now can do is we can simply publish this. So when we go to my website here, so let me go here. You can see my website. I can say publish here. And now this blog post will be automatically published to my website. This is going to take a few seconds, but basically you don't have to do this because this will all happen on autopilot. This is just if you mainly want to push the articles to your website. So let's see if it's already there. Let me refresh. Yes, it's there. The ultimate guide to maximizing social media engagement. Now, one thing that I've said to uh, Cyril, the developer, is please... When you create a post, also make this featured image. So you can see this image here. Now I have to do this manually. He promised me to add this to an update here, which basically means when you go to your website, you have this featured image on your blog automatically as well. But here you can see the article has been published to my website. And all of this can be done on autopilot here inside of Blogi. So this is the campaign. And right now there's one campaign. You can see five articles have been written. So I can create a new campaign. You can add multiple campaigns right into one website. Now here you can see the articles. Now they are all published, but there are a few extra options like the rewriter. So let's say you find an article online. So let's say we go to Neil Patel here. We have Neil Patel's website and Let's say we want to take one of his articles. So it says here how to write title tags uh, for SEO. So I'm going to copy this and I'm going to paste that in here. And now we go back to his website. His website is full of pop-ups, pretty annoying. Um, that comes back. So when you click them away, they come back again. But let's say, um, let's say, okay, we have this article here. And we're going to paste that inside of Blogi. Now, when we click on rewrite here, 
uh, Blogi will rewrite us. Now, first we need to select the campaign. So we wanna have this in our social media marketing campaign that's going to post to my website. And here again, you can choose the model that you wanna use to write this software. So let's say for this one, we're gonna use here uh, GPT 3.5, for example. And here you can also choose para by para, but you can click on rewrite now, and now it will rewrite the article for you. And it's gonna take about uh, 30 seconds to a minute. And there you go, here is the article written for you. Well, let's go to the articles here. So now we can see, yeah, this is the article here. Yeah, so normally, I don't know why I'm not able to edit this one. I will ask that to Surreal, but if I'm correct, you should be able to uh, edit your articles in here. Um, but in this case, let's, let's publish this one as well. And let's go to the writer option. Maybe it's in here where I can uh, add extra options to my campaign. So again, here we choose the model. So let's say this is cloud. We want to do English here. The topic, let's say here as topic here, what is an influencer style, professional, and then the keywords, uh, influencer. And let's click next. So now it will write an article based on a specific keyword and a specific headline for me. And there we go, there is the article. And this is the article that I was looking for here. So here are the options to rewrite certain parts. I'm not sure why that was not possible in the rewrite section. Um, I will ask Surreal about that. Uh, but basically here, when you select something here at the top, so let's say influencer marketing, understanding the power and impact of influencers. When I select this sentence here, you can see that it's being shown here. So from here, I can say, I want to rewrite this. So when I click on this one, look, it has rewritten this sentence here. I can rewrite it again. And if I want to use this one, I simply click on here and it will be replaced here in my blog article. I can also say, I want to expand this piece of content here. So if I want to make this longer, I can say, okay, I want to expand this and then it will write a whole piece of content for this specific line in here so you can see here look what it wrote here for this specific line in this case i'm not going to replace that but what i'm going to do here is i'm going to add an image so when i click on image here it will use the content here and it will create an image for this blog post so when we scroll down well it's creating the image here you can see also for this post it creates the meta description the meta keywords the tags the categories etc you can change that in here if you'd like to change or add other categories as well um the image is almost done so i think i put my mouse at the wrong button now so you can see here now it's adding the image at the tags here but basically normally it should let me see if i can replace that in here yep there is the image now. So this is now the image that's being used. And I can say here, I can add this to the queue so that it will be used on the specific days that I specified. Or I can publish this immediately, or I can download this here, or I can save the change. So when I save the change here, uh, let's download this. Let's see what happens. Okay, this is an article as a zip file. And let me see. Okay, so this is becoming... Uh, when I open this, you can see it's like an HTML file that's being opened. So you can do that as well. So when we go back to the articles, you can see here is the article in draft and I can publish it anytime I like. Now then what I want to point out is that this is a credit-based system here. So for each uh, blog post that you write, it will cost you articles here. And depending on what you do with your articles, how long they are, etc. So I have articles from 100 uh, credits here, from 250 here. Um, it depends on how you use the software. Now, you can buy more credits. So it comes, I think the bundle comes with 30,000 credits, but you can buy more credits here. Basically, you almost purchase this for the same price as the, you would be paying when you pay to... Um, open ai to chat gpt and all the others now the cool thing is normally you pay to chat gpt for the plus functions 20 dollars per month and for all the other services you have to pay 20 dollars per month now it's included all inside of blogging and once you're 
run out of credits, you simply can buy more. So 1,200 credits is $1 here. So if you like to have 6,000 credits, it will only cost you $5 uh, and you can buy much more if you like to, you know, if you want to have 96,000 or 48,000, just depending on what you want here. Uh, but 6,000 credits, you can write a bunch of stuff for, five, for $5 here. Uh, and then you can update it and you can start working on your blogy. And that's basically what Blogi is all about. Uh, it writes these cool articles for you. It creates your website, which is automatically updated, uh, SEO optimized. I think it's pretty cool. So uh, yeah, in case you're interested, again, check out the link in the description uh, for more information, for coupons, for some free extras if you pick this up through my link. And if you have any questions, Make sure to, uh, to ask them in the comments below. And uh, please hit a thumbs up if this video was useful. Um, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't done yet. And uh, thank you so much for watching. And I hope to see you in my next video. Talk soon. Cheers.